So we're taking water that's leaving the Marine Science Institute and passing it through the cells using sunlight to raise its temperature and increase its vaporization rate and using that cold water itself to recondense that steam, thereby increasing the system's efficiencies and transform pure seawater into two bodies of water, one being slightly enriched salinity and the other pure water. Uh, those are the things we're really going to try and characterize here are the flow rate and the temperatures that you need to have the maximized water production. One of the things we have to maintain is zero environmental impact is certainly the goal. Because of the low efficiency of photovoltaic cells, typically around 20 percent, and the very high energy consumption of reverse osmosis systems, using sun directly to raise the temperature of water in an efficient manner can produce an, an overall system efficiency on the order of 50 to 1. We have to remember that about 60 percent of the world population lives within 10 miles of the coastline. So if a system like this is deployed effectively, essentially we'll be solving humanity's search for portable water. Join us in the development of this renewable resource technology and support our Worldview Water campaign and all of its product lines and help us permanently solve the water issue worldwide.